Well, I just want to take this opportunity to thank Tracy and Neil for all the work they did. Tracy has been going crazy, hardly resting. Tracy. Yeah, Tracy. Tracy. And I always appreciate her so much. I don't know what I would have done without Tracy. Whenever you need her, she's always there. She's a pretty wonderful daughter. Thanks, Tracy, for everything. And I assume you wanted to say thank you to Neil for yeah. uh, coming down, coming here, playing music all his life, just like I wanted to do. <laughs> um, uh, actually, he's going to be a doctor, which I'm very proud of. Yeah. Yes. Yay. And uh, to tell you the truth, uh, I knew that there was some, some kind of speeches to be made and whatever, but I lost my ability to write speeches. And uh, I don't talk that much normally. But, uh, <laughs> everyone here knows that uh, we've had a pretty open home all of our lives, and we've played a lot of music with a heck of a lot of good musicians sang a lot of songs, like Stan, Stan, he sings a lot of songs, but he's getting lazy lately. <laughs> but uh, I can't hardly believe that uh, it's 50 years since we got married, my God, the Queen's only 60 years since she became Queen. <laughs> Yeah, she got uh, coronated on the same day as we got married, so uh, we have a relationship there somewhere. <laughs> uh, but all my friends, some aren't here, some uh, have gone to the great beyond, and we'll see them later sometime, I hope in another 15 or 20 years. But uh, we, we shall try. And. Uh, all these young girls over here, we look at the, just the sheer beauty of these girls is amazing. I don't know where Rissa found them, but she did a good job. <laughs> and all my relatives. Friends. And friends, like, uh, like Gary, what's his last name, Emerson? Yeah. <laughs> Here, Brenda. Thank you, Brenda. I never got to uh, say hello to you yet, but I will. And uh, Bruce, our next door neighbor, and... Our gift from God, truthfully. I have to interrupt. We have the best neighbor over there, right over there. Um, <laughs> who does our laneway, who trims our hedges, who who just does everything. Um, we could not ask for better neighbors. So I thank you for a for <laughs> Anyway, the, the best neighbors, the best neighbors. We're lucky to have them. Yeah, and if everybody remembers back to the days when we used to go up the Gap No and we would stop in Wakefield and... Uh, see all those animals and uh, I think there was bears at one time there. Bears. And bears and uh, I know there was geese that would pinch your butt if you got too close to them. <laughs> but that was Bruce's grandfather that uh, that made that place and uh, I was really glad to see when he moved in next door. <laughs> so Then I'll have to say Joey and Ashley, we've just met them in the last couple of years, and uh, lots of fun out at their place. I, I think they'll get it set up to where they'll probably take over from music night. <laughs> <laughs> the jamboree. <laughs> but we are going to have another jamboree at Shaver Mountain this year. Wow. And, uh, yeah. And I'm going to babysit mom, so don't worry about it. It's all good. <laughs> 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 
But what can I say to have a daughter like Tracy and a son like Neil and friends like I have? I don't know why God blessed me so much, but he sure did. And I'm, I'm a happy guy. So I'll let my daughter take over now. She talks like I do. <laughs>